what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to some more sons of anarchy the series is crazy okay uh, we all know that uh, got a couple more seasons to go gonna continue season six man uh, this show is just just one of those shows man where, you, where you're just like okay it's winding down you don't really want it to end but at the same time you want it to end because you want to move on to the next thing you want to watch right so um things that are going on around the town right now with jacks with, with everybody that's involved right now it's it's just you know him giving up um him giving up tig was it was heartbreaking i don't know man i don't even know what to think let's just jump into the reaction i'll see you guys for the review all right what's going on guys that was two of the best episodes of sons of anarchy that i've watched over the years and we're in season six and i know some of you guys are probably thinking oh he's not enjoying the show anymore that's why he's not listen i just it just so happens that the past couple of weekends have been just weird okay it's just since i've started season six like stuff just kept happening and i just haven't been able to really go ham on the series like i used to so that's all that is i am enjoying the series bruh the writing in this series has been top notch it's top notch um it's just to the point where you don't think certain things is going to happen and you think they would you know it, one of the instances i really thought they were the irish was going to come around but then when chibs started to talk about how far this racism runs i was like there's no way they, they, they might as well be the aryan brotherhood at this point like you, you know what i'm saying like they might as well be the aryan brotherhood like i didn't know i didn't know that the, it's that bad like it runs that deep especially with irish i mean you talk about i mean i don't know and the thing about it is like i love irish women like i i love irish women i did i would have never known that racism runs deep in, in in that country that well it's just like the other day where i was like i didn't know that racism was so bad in the sports in in the sport of soccer right or soccer or football as you call it for real right i didn't know i was just talking to my brother the other day and i and and, and i was like i didn't know it's just that in recent years that i've really understood you know what i'm saying because i've never seen it happen and i used to watch soccer a lot back in the day and I never really saw any examples of racism where, you know, I heard fans throw bananas at players. And I mean, wow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, so it's just for me, it's, it's just that if Chips have never said that, because for me, it's just it, it's like this, right? For me, it's like this. I never assume that people are racist. That's just me. Some people do. And I think that. I think that's wrong. I think it's wrong for you to assume that people are racist just because of their skin color. And it, 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 it's, you get what I'm trying to say? It's like white people, you just automatically think that that, that person is racist. You have no interaction with that person, but you just automatically think that they're racist based on their skin color. You get what I'm saying? And based on the fact that they're white, I don't operate like that. So for me, if I don't see the person commit a, a, a racist act or say something towards that end, I cannot assume that that person is racist. You get what I'm saying? Like, I, I just, I can't, I don't, I don't know. Maybe I'm just wired different, but I, I, I just expect I always go into new situation expecting 
the best out of that person the best i expect them to be a certain type of person until they show me that otherwise i always expect the best and to towards that end yes i've gotten burned in, in, in you know in the past by you know trusting people and stuff like that but it never changed me because i feel like when we approach situations like in, in you know with assumptions it can get you in deep water it, and, it, and it's just a terrible way to approach situations i know everybody's not like me i know there's a ton of black people out there as soon as they see a white person racist and it it hurts me <laughs> it, it it's it bothers me to think that people actually think like that because you know and i get it it's like you automatically just there's a switch that goes off in your head that just automatically thinks that this person is just evil you know or they they, they just gonna straight up call you the n-word or whatever the situation is it's it, it's just it baffles me so I never really thought of it, uh, thought of them as, you know, the Irish, you know, or the IRA as people who hate. I don't know the history of the IRA. I know it's an actual real organization, you know, whether back in the day or no, it is. I don't know if it's still going on, but I know it's a real organization, right? So I didn't know that racism runs very deep in their culture. You get what I'm saying? In, 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 in Irish culture, I never knew that. Like, I've always thought, when it comes on to, to, to Scotland, Ireland, I've always thought of those countries as very exotic countries. To me, you know what I'm saying? Or they just, they, 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 they have the, the, the way how they talk has always been fascinating to me. You know what I'm saying? And their accent has always been very unique. You know, it's kind of like a mix of a mix of the, the the english cockney and and something else you get what i'm saying like that's always just been fascinated to me about their culture and to i'm not saying that it, it, i guess i'm just ignorant i guess of the fact that maybe hints were there towards that and i just didn't recognize it so when it comes on to this series man i just have to i just have to say hands down they they really got me going there um but chibs is right those guys are not gonna take that they're gonna take that as a slap in the face it's like you might as well said can i rape your mom you know what i'm saying <laughs> you know i know youtube found um i know they they frown upon people saying that r word but i don't care i'm you know for monetization purposes it's just it's just weird to me like you can't say these words it's not like you're not even talking about that in the context of you know what I'm saying? It's like, who are you trying to keep safe? Our content is not made for kids. Why are you, you know, censoring us from saying actual words that are in the dictionary? It's so, it's dumb to me, but it's whatever. Um, so situation that happened with Gemma, I'm really sorry about that. I didn't want to see her put in a situation like that again. Um, I don't know how the sheriff is going to take this now that the freaking motor club they don't have nowhere to go now to meet up. It's all blown up. Irish means business, bro. They don't play games. You know what I'm saying? They don't play games. And this is probably going to be their toughest fight in the series so far. What are they going to do in the next couple of episodes? I don't know. But this is this is getting serious. Um, I don't know how the, sh the sheriff is there to witness this. I don't know what happened. I don't know if they're going to play it off and be like, hey, you know, a gas leak or whatever. I don't know if they're going to actually tell the sheriff, hey, the Irish is trying to kill all of us. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so this is just crazy. This is just nuts. The stuff that's going on with Tara and Wendy, like doing all this behind her back. I understand why she's doing it, but it's just not the best way of going about it. Because she's like, it's inevitable I'm going to go to jail. I need you to take care of them understandable understandable but that's still their father it's still their father and i hate the fact that she's doing this behind their back and i get i get it it's to get the boys away from the club but i think jack's seeing this from a, from a certain angle he, he 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 could make this decision he just doesn't want his kids with wendy because he just doesn't trust her i don't really trust her 100 percent 
to be honest i don't you get what i'm saying so he, uh, Jax is off the rails he's doing a lot of things that i that i did not expect him to do and i'm not gonna praise him for that you know what i'm saying he has flaws a lot of flaws and a lot of stuff that's going on right now yes it's very similar stuff to what clay did but at the same time he's doing it for the betterment of the club not for himself he's trying to get them out of all of these bad situations and bad businesses and the guns and the drugs and the, all of this other stuff he's just trying to sever all of that stuff from the club so they can go legit and make legitimate money and live in peace and don't have to worry about people trying to you know what i'm saying don't have to walk around looking behind your back every every two seconds to see who's coming up behind me people you want to live free and that's the thing the thing about it is that what i always say is criminals cannot you can't expect to make a living off of crime and then later on in life trying to go legit with no consequences life doesn't work like that you know what i'm saying life just doesn't work like that but um i don't know how things are going to retaliate from here all i know is two of the best episodes of the series so far that i've watched together awesome stuff anyways guys thank you guys so much for tuning in hopefully you guys enjoy these reactions for what they are man i really do appreciate you guys for coming through and watching sons of anarchy with me let me know what you think of these two episodes in the comment section i know you guys don't usually leave any comments for these videos um every now and then you do but i would really appreciate it if you if you do it this time around <laughs> like comment subscribe if you're new it's your boy terabyte reacts i'm out peace Thank you.